Mom, I'm hungry. Then start photosynthesizing. The sun is shining bright. Use it. I know, I know. But my leaves need rest, you know. Your leaves don't get tired. They are meant to photosynthesize. Do you know how important we are for this world to go on? Let me explain. Plants are very important to us. All food people eat comes directly or indirectly from plants. For example, apples come from an apple tree. The flour used to make bread comes from a wheat plant. Meat comes from a goat. And we all know that goats are animals, not plants, right? But what does the goat eat? It eats grass and hay. Plants. So all the foods we eat come from plants. But what do plants eat? They make their own food. Plants need several things to make their own food. Plants get their raw material for photosynthesis from the soil, the air and the sun. When it rains, water gets absorbed in the soil. The plants take in the water from the soil through its roots. In the roots, there are tubes which are called the xylem and phloem. The xylem lies towards the interior part of the root whereas the phloem lies towards the exterior part of the root. These tubes help in bringing water and minerals from the soil to its leaves. Leaves breathe in carbon dioxide from tiny pores which are called stomata which are on the underside of the leaf. Now that we have carbon dioxide and water, we are ready for photosynthesis, right? Wrong! We are missing the most important ingredient, the sun. Now the process will start. It is in the leaf of the plant that most of the action takes place. If we cut a leaf and see it under a microscope, we see that right below the outer layer of cells, there is a layer of soft elongated cells called mesophyll cells. Inside the mesophyll cells are tiny nodes which are called chloroplasts. Chloroplasts contain a special chemical called chlorophyll. It is chlorophyll which colors the leaves green. When the light energy from the sun is captured by the chloroplast, it is stored in stacks called a granum in which is the thylakoid membrane. In these membranes, the chemical reaction of photosynthesis takes place. So remember, carbon dioxide plus water plus sun gives you glucose plus oxygen. The glucose or sugar is the food which the plant has made for itself and is distributed to all parts of the body and oxygen is a waste gas which the plants breathe out. People and animals use this very oxygen to breathe and continue living. <laughs>